Hey guys, actually on my way to pick my son up from a wrestling camp and I, uh, I, <laughs> I, I had a comment out there that I thought was humorous. So I, I thought I'd just kind of respond to it kind of in mass, you know, in mass meeting that the few people probably pay any attention to anything I have to say. So, uh, you know, being a little nothing guy that decided to, you know, put some thoughts and opinions out on YouTube rather than just kind of listening and you know, taking that information in and doing with it what I, what I might. Um, just thought to kind of put some ideas and, and thoughts out there to, for other people to kind of speculate on and possibly motivate them to do the same thing. But in any event, <laughs> I actually had a video out there where I kind of talked about uh, Mandela and the Mandela effect and how it could explain, you know, kind of irra what I perceive as irrational behavior between good friends of mine, smart people that just see the world in a completely different way. And obviously, it's, everything is political these days, and, and someone made the comment about not politicizing Mandela, which was kind of interesting. And I guess what struck me was, even though the, the idea crossed my mind that this whole Mandela effect and multiple timelines and experiences and activities might be influencing a thought process which is completely different than mine, which would explain why my thought process doesn't doesn't align with what they're thinking. And it, 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 there's just no common ground to have a, a thoughtful conversation. I kind of got away from other social media avenues like Facebook because it just wasn't constructive and all it was was just stirring up anxieties and, 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 and anger. in the sense that, again, I'm, I'm kind of a nobody and I'll, there's only a few people that have kind of noticed some of the things that I'm putting out there. The fact that I that that thought process kind of raised some eyebrows and some negative feedback um, is what kind of, kind of caught me off a little bit and made me think, hmm, maybe there's something to this. So, <laughs> I have to apologize for a lot of my camera. I don't usually do that. Usually I'm in a standing position having a conversation, but I thought I'd do this in the car while I had time. So, in any event, like I said, it was, there was a negative comment out there. I'm not going to get full, I mean, you know, 
knock yourself out, you know, whatever you, whatever your opinions or thoughts are, knock yourself out. That's the whole point of, you know, these free platforms and these free streams of thought um, platforms that people have out there. But um, I'm not going to go in there and start d diatribing back and forth on one thing or another. But, you know, why would anybody say an idea don't politicize it? I mean, an idea, an idea is an idea. If the Mandela effect is creating these parallel tangent universes with different different facts behind it that could skew people's thinking and why in this political world, this politicized world we live in, people are at each other's throats. If that if that can explain it, that can explain it. I mean, why should I not politicize I'm not politicizing it, I'm just I'm thinking, I'm thinking through a perspective that might explain a lot of things that I find just absolutely asinine. And anyway, I just thought I'd put that out there. So, again, just you know, on the lighter side, I'm uh, on my way to pick my son up from wrestling. Uh, he's, he's really killing it. Um, and that he's going to be a rising sophomore coming here. And he wants to he wants to go to the next level, he told me. He wants to compete for state in his weight class, which is going to be probably around the 125 weight class will be my guess. 125 or 135. He was at 150, 113 last year. I, I, I see him bulking up. Finally, he's starting to hit the weights. He's really kind of doing that extra effort that I think he can that he can do to be competitive at the next level. He made regionals last year, and that was that was as far as he got. So, anyway, exciting times. Um, thoughts and prayers go out to our president. Thoughts and prayers go out to we the people that are behind him. I'm behind him. Um, if and when the time comes that I need to do my part to fight the good fight to you know, bring love and harmony back to everything that we want. Because I, I believe the universe naturally wants to be peaceful and loving. And the evil side of it all wants the opposite of that. That's, that's kind of how I think and, and what have you. So I'm ready to, 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 to do my part to support that effort. He can't do it by himself. And if it gets to a point where, you know, we the people have to kind of be a more proactive participant behind what we're striving for, you know, count me in. Um, anyway, um, all the best everybody out there and love your feedback.